Hello everyone, and welcome to my bold and beautiful 24 channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Finn gleefully informs Steffi that she is not responsible for the death of his biological mother, while Sheila provokes her at the hospital. Steffi inquires of Finn at the cliff home. What is the remarkable news? He informs her. You will find it hard to believe. Steffi is incredulous at the level of excitement he is displaying and inquires, Could you please provide me with an explanation of the current situation? Finn responds, The process commences with sugar. At Deacon's apartment he wants to take Sheila to Vegas and marry her tonight. Sheila jests that perhaps she is reconsidering her decision. Deacon dramatically pretends to have a knife to the heart. He describes the intense emotional turmoil he experienced during her absence. He doesn't want to lose her again. Deacon pledges to get her a ring. Sheila assures him that he has no obligation towards her. She acknowledges that she is only present because of him. She shuts her eyes and informs him that she is slightly disoriented. Deacon strongly urges them to go to the office and have her examined. He brings her water and recalls that Finn wanted her to go to the hospital and she refused. He's not fooling around with her health. He strives to convince her at length, suggesting they may come home later and play a different kind of doctor. Sheila giggles and agrees. Deacon promises her they'll be back there planning their nuptials before she knows it. They kiss. More. JMW considers a family addition. At Forrester, Hope is reading a story online about Sheila being deceased. She flashes to finding she's alive. Suddenly, Ridge and Liam enter the office after a meeting and observe her grimacing in her chair. Liam wonders if she's okay. She's honestly not sure how to answer it. Liam wonders if she was unable to talk Deacon out of the Sheila is alive bullshit. Hope says her dad's not crazy. He's right. Sheila is alive. More Scott Clifton's son Ford in photos. Rich can't believe this and asks if Hope is doing the same thing today. Hope insists Deacon's not making anything up. Ridge rants. Hope come on. Sheila is dead. My daughter stuck a knife in her. Hope exclaims. Except she isn't dead Ridge. I saw her. Sheila is alive. Ridge Liam Hope BNB. After having heard the account, Rich states that this is insane. He's heard the stories about Sugar too, but she's not part of this story. Hope had a hard time with it too. She came hellbent on forcing her dad to give up on this hypothesis, but the door opened and Sheila was just standing there. She was so astonished she actually passed out. When she came to she was still there. The woman Steffi killed that night was not Sheila. It was her lookalike Sugar. Hope believes she didn't only see Sheila, she spoke to her and she spoke back. Sheila Carter is alive, whether we like it or not. More Finn and Hope are poised to bond. In the hospital, the nurse fusses over Sheila while Deacon tries to keep them engaged. Deacon remembers he left his phone in the car. Sheila assures him she'll be all right, so he goes. The nurse asks how long they've been engaged. Sheila smiles. Would you believe a few hours? She tells the nurse they were engaged before, but this time it's going to be different. Everything is going to be different. Just then, Sheila hears Lee's voice on the other side of the curtain. She grins and asks the nurse if Dr. Finnegan might see her. The nurse agrees to go speak to her. In the corridor, the nurse tells Lee that there's a patient looking for her. She's suffering from dehydration and starvation. Her name is Sheila. At the cliff house, Steffi asks, What about Sugar? Finn says she's a human. Steffi asks, And you know this person? Finn doesn't know her at all. Steffi's quite confused. Finn proposes they sit down and then tells her, this whole thing is just unfathomable what I'm about to tell you. He knows it will be hard for her to believe, but it is genuine. Steffi wonders. What's real? Finn, you're not making any sense. He tells her Sugar is a woman who looks exactly like Sheila. Steffi stammers. Double chut. She wants to know what this Sugar person has to do with Sheila. Finn answers. Everything. Steffi Finn BNB. At Forrester. Rich goes over Hope having seen and chatted to Sheila at Deacon's house. Hope wouldn't believe it either if she hadn't seen her for herself. It was Sugar who went to Steffi's residence that night, not Sheila. She knows they've been thinking they were secure from Sheila, but she was actually a victim. Liam grunts and Ridge asks, What? Sheila is a victim? Is that what you just said? 
Ridge asks if she realizes how far-fetched this sounds. Hope is definite after today. Sheila Carter lives on. Ridge Liam Hope BNB. At the hospital, Sheila grins from ear to ear as she hears the nurse ask Lee whether she's all right. Lee exhales and whispers the name Sheila used to send a thrill down her spine. Thankfully, not any longer. Full of delight, Sheila covers up as she hears Lee confirm she'll see the patient. Lee pulls down the curtain and asks her to pull the cover down so she may examine her. Sheila fights laughs underneath the sheet. As Lee's about to walk out, Sheila rips the covers off of her feet. Lee stammers, your toe. What happened? Is that why you're here? You want me to examine your missing toe? Remove that sheet. Show me your face. More fins in for a massive shock. At the cliff home, Finn tells Steffi that Sugar looks so much like Sheila it's impossible to tell them apart. They could be identical twins. He explains it was Lauren Fenmore that notified Deacon about Sugar. Years ago, Sheila fooled Sugar into obtaining plastic surgery, so the woman would be convicted for Sheila's crimes. Sugar wound up in a mental facility. Steffi questions why he's bringing all this up. Finn reveals that Sugar and Sheila are identical in every single aspect bar one. Sugar has all her toes. Steffi Finn BNB. Finn reveals that Deacon was scared Sugar had it in for Sheila, so they combed through her credit card history and tracked her down. We found her, Steffi, in an old abandoned warehouse. Steffi exclaims, You found Sugar. Finn says no, they found Sheila. Steffi says Sheila is dead. She died in their residence right there on the floor. Finn knows that's what she believed, but it wasn't Sheila. Steffi believes Deacon is losing it and he's obviously got into his head somehow. Finn says Deacon saw Sugar's body at the incinerator, not Sheila's. Do you know what that means, honey? It means you didn't kill my birth mother. You didn't kill Sheila. She's alive. My birth mother is alive. Sheila's proposal answer. Finn's risky new mission. The bold and the beautiful spoilers for Wednesday. May 8th state that Sheila Carter, Kimberlyn Brown, gives Deacon Sharp, Sean Cannon, an answer to his marriage proposal. Coming up on the bold and the beautiful. After conversing to Hope Logan, Annika Noel, John Finn Finnegan, Tanner Novlin, starts on a new quest. However, Finn's miracle bombshell might not garner the reaction from Steffi Forrester Finnegan, Jacqueline McInnes Wood, that he's hoping for. Keep reading to find out what is coming up in the next episode of the CBS soap opera. The Bold and the Beautiful Spoilers Deacon Sharp's Marriage Proposal BNB Spoilers for Wednesday May 8th state that Deacon and Sheila will still be outside on the balcony. Deacon has just proposed to Sheila yet again. Fans might recall that Deacon proposed to Sheila earlier. This time, Sheila will probably say yes, but the wedding will have a lot of controversy. BNB Spoilers Sheila Carter's Answer On Wednesday, May 8th, fans will probably see Sheila's reaction to Deacon's marriage proposal. Deacon is so grateful that Sheila is alive and believes she has changed for the better. Sheila also has the support of her son, Finn. Now that Sheila has been saved, Finn and Deacon want her to have the finest second chance possible. So, will Sheila tell Deacon yes to his marriage proposal? The Bold and the Beautiful Spoilers John Finnegan's New Mission The Bold and the Beautiful Spoilers for Wednesday May 8th hint that Finn will embark on a new mission. Finn helped Deacon save Sheila's life. Finn says he believes Sheila's tale and also feels she has changed. However, Hope Logan, Annika Noel, isn't so sure. Hope is being supportive of Finn, though. The look on Hope's face as she embraced Finn was alarming. Could Hope's instincts be right? B&B Spoilers Wednesday, May 8, 2024 On Wednesday's episode, fans might also see Finn get ready to tell Steffi what he's really been doing instead of working at the hospital. Unless I missed anything. It doesn't appear that Finn told Steffi he was out searching for Sheila. Now, Finn will need to notify Steffi that Sheila is alive. While Finn expects Steffi will be glad she didn't kill his birth mother, the good doctor is wrong. Steffi is going to utterly go nuts over this miracle revelation. It might herald the end of Steffi and Finn's marriage. With Hope's endorsement, does it imply Hen could happen? Which narrative are you looking forward to witnessing the most on Wednesday, May 8, 2024? What are your predictions for Deacon, Sheila, Steffi, and Finn? What does the future hold for Steffi, Liam Spencer, Scott Clifton, and the rest of the characters? Share your opinions in the comment area below. Remember to keep watching The Soap on CBS or Paramount Plus to find out what happens next.